So, we want to import our noisy recording into Audacity. You'll hear there's a sound of lots of traffic coming from outside. To get rid of that, you'll want to highlight the noisy section. Then go to Effect, Noise Reduction, and click Get Noise Profile. Highlight everything using Ctrl A, go back to Effect and Noise Reduction. Don't worry too much about the settings, you can just hit OK. This is the recording without noise reduction. OK, this is a noisy recording. Noise, noise, everywhere. This is the recording with noise reduction enabled. Much nicer. OK, this is a noisy recording. Noise, noise, everywhere. Now we'll walk through the same thing using Reaper. Import your noisy audio recording. Reaper is a little bit different and we have to add the noise reduction as a plugin. Noise, noise, everywhere. Click the effects button on your track, search for FIR and choose the plugin that comes up. Change the mode from EQ to subtract and tick the Automatically Build box. Hit play and Reaper will build the noise profile for you. Make sure you untick the box when you're finished, otherwise you'll be layering the effect on top of itself. Now you can hear the background noise is mostly gone. Noise, noise, everywhere. For comparison, here's the track with the effect turned off. Noise, noise, everywhere. Turn the effect back on. Right click the track and go to apply track slash take effects to items as a new take, mono output. We now have two takes. You can turn the effect off now as we've already rendered a take with it on. Highlight the old noisy take and right click. Go to take and select delete active take. Now you're left with only the nice quiet take. Okay, this is a noisy recording. Noise, noise everywhere.